welcome to Real Issue Podcast. I am your host, Martel Llewellyn from Breaking NBA News. CJ McCollum has agreed to a two-year, $64 million contract extension with the Pelicans. I don't think people talk about this enough. I think the Pelicans got CJ McCollum for nothing. I think they robbed the Portland Trailblazers. I believe that CJ McCollum is a top 30 player right now. Last season with the Pelicans, he averaged 24.3 points. He shot 49.3% from the field, 4.5 rebounds, and 5.8 assists. I think he's a great veteran player. He's 31 years old. He's a pretty decent guard. He's 6'3". He could score on all three levels of the court. I think that him and Dame back in the day had many great battles in the Western Conference. I think he's proved that as long as you're able to put a solid group around CJ McCollum, he's a solid player. I think that the Pelicans are a huge sleeper team. I think if Zion can stay healthy, also too, Brandon Ingram, he's only getting better and better. People are even comparing him to KD. I don't think he's right there yet, but he's pretty close in terms of his style of play. I think CJ McCollum is going to bring a great veteran presence to that team. And I think, like I said before, that the Pelicans are a huge sleeper team. I think if you can have Zion, you know, play at somewhat like of an all-star level along with Brandon Mingham, I think they're one of the dark horses of the Western Conference. And in my opinion, they're a team that you don't want to play them in the first round. I think that if you have CJ healthy, Zion, and Brandon Ingram healthy, they're a problem in the Western Conference. I think the only thing that they're lacking is uh, maybe veteran leadership or experience in the playoffs, but that's what CJ McCollum is there for. I think that if CJ McCollum can tap into you know, some of his younger days. Not that he's going to be like that the whole season, but like, share, comment, subscribe as we continue to push to 700 subscribers.